Hello everybody, welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Today, I guess we're going to be going to the Yig Clan hideout as voted by for uh, Well Jeepers in chat. I'm super excited. Currently, we're in Terrytown. Uh, actually, first, let's go get the Rito. The Rito friend. For Terrytown. Yeah, we're, we're going to get the Rito friend for uh, Terrytown. Then we're going to go to the Yiga clan hideout. It's going to be a good time. Because I'm not good at stealth. <laughs> I actually, I don't remember at all. Oh, what is this? Keel, where are you? Can't find Keel anywhere. Where could she be? Maybe she went to Warbler's Nest. Oh, this is a shrine quest. Maybe it's not a shrine quest, but... How long do I normally stream? Uh, I stream for two, like, two to three hours, typically. Like, per game. And I'm pretty much only playing Breath of the Wild right now, so... That reminds me, I need to adjust my monitor so I can see the chat better. I always forget to do that before I start streaming. Definitely my, your treadmill buddy? Awesome, love to hear it. <laughs> Be hopping on in like an hour or so? Okay, awesome. I need to start working out again. It's been a while. Uh, I don't actually remember where the Rito friend is. Cecily? Oh, that's a that's just a Hylian. Uh, let's see. What about you? Yeah. Faison. Oh, okay, we found him. Faison. You started back up. Okay. I feel that. <laughs> I'm I'm super out of shape myself. My mom said she wants me to take over the family store someday. Can you believe that? I don't. I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Mm. But I don't want to compete with my mom. I wish there was a place I can set up my own shop. Huh? Heard of Terrytown? Terrytown, tell me more. Oh, so you're in need of a general store. That's perfect. But the Akala region, that's pretty far out there. I guess I got to leave the nest someday. And I have my own and I have my own store. <laughs> okay, I made up my mind. I'm going. I know I'll gather some items on the way to Terrytown and then sell them at my new shop. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. And hey, don't be a stranger. Come visit me in my new home sometime. As a sign, you can be a little much and recognize that. Oh, no, that's fine. I, I love chatters. I love interacting with chat. It makes me happy. Feels a little more personal, you know. Okay, let's head back to Terrytown. <laughs> Definitely bring my A game. Awesome. I appreciate it. <laughs> okay. Down to Terrytown we go. Helps I forget the right way. Look at it, it's coming along greatly. Got all these houses and stuff built. It's looking good. 
Do I have any dinner plans? Um, not really. My mother is wanting me to go to like Wendy's later, so I guess I'm getting Wendy's again. Which I'm okay with. I like Wendy's. Hey, there he is. Hey. Managed to find a Rito and bring him back here. Thank you. You wasted no time getting a general store up and running. Apparently his family runs one too. With a name like Fison, he'll fit right in. He's selling things that he's picked up while flying around. Should really go check out the store. Well, next is... Uh-huh. So before we can call more people here, we need even more homes. Can you bring me 50 bundles of what? Do I have it? I might not have that. Oh, oh I have barely enough. You love Wendy's on a uh, no Uber Eats. That's fair. Um, I don't normally buy no Uber Eats. I just go to the restaurant myself. Uber Eats is so expensive. Mm. Actually, wanted to talk about something a little personal. Oh, not that kind of personal, actually. I got engaged. Congratulations. Thank you. To who? To Ronson. You're a cute couple. Thank you. Anyway, we want to have a little ceremony to celebrate, but we need some priest-like to officiate. Can you find me someone priest-like for us? Priest-like, uh huh? If you're looking for devote enough, it's just the Zora. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bolton construction policy. Got to end in sun. Uh, okay. I guess we're going to Zora's domain. I don't have the wood to. Build the next part of Terrytown, though. Unless that's the last part. Nia's Yoma Shrine. Okay, it should be easy enough to find someone priest-like here. I actually had business to attend to here anyway. La la la, your trial awaits, it's glowing bright. Oh, you're the Hylian who helped our Prince Sidon. You're so handsome. Your looks still don't compare to Prince Sidon, of course. But you're not half bad. In fact, I wouldn't mind taking you with me for a bit. <laughs> you're a little too young for me, girl. So. You had a problem I was ordering Uber Eats like every other day. <laughs> yeah, I eat out a lot too, but I don't do or U Uber Eats or DoorDash or anything like that. I just my town is small enough. I just I, I go and get the food. Let me hear. Yeah, I want to hear it. Okay, I'm gonna sing it. The Champion Festival song. A gift from the sky, a scale of light splits the feet of a veiled full of sight. Your trial awaits. It's glowing bright. I don't really get what the song's about, but I'm going to sing it in the next Champions Festival. Mr. Trello was supposed to get the festival together, but he hasn't done anything for it yet. I wonder what's wrong with him. Did he forget about his job? You want Indian food so badly, though? I've never really had Indian food. I've had, like, curry and stuff, but... Where we are, yeah. Okay. I'm looking for the person uh, working on the railing. I don't remember where he's at. Hey, Feriel, how's it going? Popping in the lurk? That's fair. I appreciate it. <laughs> Riven. It's me, Riven. We used to swim together when I was a child, remember? I don't remember. Uh, okay. I don't remember the guy who uh, buys the uh, luminous stone. Have a good lay down, yeah? Yeah, definitely. Definitely have a nice lay down, Feriel. Take it easy. That's a threat. If you don't take it easy, you're going to fall in the water like Link just did.
Wait, climbing up ladders isn't supposed to exhaust you. Whatever. Indian food is so good. Uh, do yourself a favor. Chicken tikka masala, samosas, and mango lassi. Hmm, okay. I'll have to try them. I had a friend who really liked samosas. And uh, I think I've had chicken tikka masala before. Maybe. I, I at least know what that is. I'll get some, like, garlic naan with it, too. I'm pretty sure there's, uh, there's a couple Indian restaurants, like, the next town over. Um, where is the guy that... Maybe he only does it during that day. What are you doing? Ah, oh, there's some snails. Wait, I don't talk to the Zora. I want the sneaky river snails. This guy has a quest for us. Torfu. Hi, Lian, to think you were able to appease Ruta. Turned out to be a pretty incredible guy. In fact, I wonder if you can do this too. Uh, I can do that. I probably won't, but I can. Forgot that garlic naan? Okay. Yeah, I gotta try. I, I really gotta try Indian food sometime. You love Zora's Domain? It's so pretty. It is. I love it. I love it too. It kind of reminds me of uh, The Fifth Element. I just watched that last night. For the first time ever. It was really good. Uzu. I might come back here during the day. Why would I sleep when I can sit by the fire? So, honestly, I love anything garlic. Garlic is just so good. They remember the fifth element? Yeah, I don't watch a lot of movies. Um, I've seen The Life of Brian and The Quest for the Holy Grail. Both were really funny. Okay, uh, yeah, there's a person working on the structure. Come here. Yes, hello! You by any chance need something. Here are the stones. And the one, and the two, and the three. Is he really... Why does this guy count them all? Okay, Count Chocula. How many luminous stones do I have now? Not enough to turn in for a diamond. Whatever. Yeah, uh, I really liked the fifth element. It was really funny. Uh, I can't say I cared for the uh, the one singer guy. Color a magic movie based on Terry Pratchett book. One of my all-time faves. Okay. I'll give it a watch then. I didn't even know that was uh, one of their movies. That or Hogfather? Okay. Yeah, I'll have to watch them both then. Uh, where would you suppose the priest here is? Luffle up. Are you a priest? You look like a priest. Hi. Yep, it's the priest. Well, well, it's always nice to have a visitor here. Thank you for joining to our fair Azora's domain. Wait a moment. You! You're Link! Perpetrator who forced Lady Mifa to join his crusade 100 years ago, only to destroy, be destroyed by the Calamity Ganon. As though I could ever forget that face. You should know that the elderly here who love Lady Mifa still remember. They still resent you. I, however, resent the dead, not the person. I also believe in allowing the mistakes of the past to wash away. Link. I retired from my role as a priest, and I am now living my life free from the material con concerns of the world. However, ever since I retired, each day is more boring than the last. Spending day after day in idleness only pass from the world soon? Link. As I'm sure you're well aware, this the afterlife lays claim to all. We never know what, what it will beckon. Yeah. I know just the place. Oh, it's not Monty Python? Oh, okay. Uh, either way. 
Did you did you ever watch the uh, the IT crowd? The IT crowd is really funny. Isn't too far away from here. Please be here by yourself. No need to worry about me. I've always had confidence in my fins and feet. A long while since I had to, had work. I need her to put my skills to good use. She come as well. Start my preparations in Terrytown in the meantime. Oh, you know what I just realized? I haven't even gotten into Gerudo Town yet, so we got to do all that before we get to the, uh, uh, you know. You, you wasn't a fan of it? Huh. Oh, well. I really like the IT crowd. Uh, I, f I forget who told me about it. I think I saw it on, like, a Reddit post or something. I was like, wow, that's really funny. Cause it was the scene where uh, Moss ha is, uh, has the fire extinguisher on fire. I, I saw most of Trailer Park Boys a few years ago. Uh, I wasn't that into it. Uh, it, was, it was funny, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, we need more wood. Where is the, uh... That's not the one I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of this one. The Serene Stable. Hello, B Raven Wings. Beck Raven Wings. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. How are you doing today? You missed all of that Twitch froze? Oh, um... I watched most of Trailer Park Boys. Uh, it just, it wasn't, it wasn't for me. I thought it was funny, though, but, I don't know. It, it kind of felt like The Office. I'm not, I'm not huge into The Office. Oh, you're a friend of Jeepers? Welcome. Any friend of Jeepers is a friend of mine. Beck is your darling love. Best friend of over 10 years. Nice. That's awesome. And you're welcome. You're welcome, Beck. Is it Beck or like Bess? I guess it would be Beck. What am I saying? Okay. Why didn't it break that one? Only 40 minutes until cobbler time? Awesome! I really want Peach Cobbler now. I haven't had it in forever. Honestly, I'd be I'd be down for any cobbler. <laughs> I really like desserts, if I'm being honest. Cake, pie, cobbler, brownies. You name it. I I love it. I'm jealous too, honestly. <laughs> like peach cobbler, that just sounds so good. Hop on your treadmill. Do make it get ready for stream. Awesome. If I'm still streaming by the time that uh you're getting on your stream, I'll raid you. You know what I really miss? I miss, uh, you share with both of us? I appreciate that. <laughs> I miss, uh, Taco Bell's Caramel Apple Empanadas. I only had them, like, once or twice. And then they got rid of them.
definitely will be done. Uh, won't be live until 7 p.m. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably I probably will be done by then. I don't stream as long as Pasta does. I don't know how he does it. He he streams all day. Mom calls them Oompa Loompas. <laughs> Almost did Peach, but uh, Hub's requested Apple. Oh, Peach. You said Peach earlier, so Peach and Apple are fine. Cobbler is cobbler. It doesn't matter what's in it. It's delicious. Yeah, it is. He, he, he I don't know how he does it. <laughs> Honestly. Like, he, he just, he streams non-stop. It seems. Like, I, I guarantee by the time I'm done streaming, he'll still be streaming. You know the underappreciated cobbler pair? What's the underappreciated cobbler pair? You get burnout for about three? I could probably do about five. About five arrows. Oh, pear cobbler. I've never had a pear cobbler, but that does sound really good. You know, honestly, pear is like a really underrated fruit. In general. Because pears are so juicy and delicious. I love them. How much wood do we have? 29? Uh, that's probably not enough. This struggle is real, I feel that. <laughs> I struggle with words like that a lot, too. Oh. Huh, that's weird, I put it on the stump. Pear cobbler sounds good. Ooh, yeah, cherry cobbler. I'm not, like, super huge into cherries. They have to be, like, really sweet. That's, like, the only, the only, like, uh, normal, normal kind of fruit I'm not, like, huge into. Though, I do remember when I was a kid, we had a cherry tree. And, uh, unfortunately, locusts ate it, like, a year later. But I, I would go on the cherry tree, and I would just, uh, I would eat all the fresh cherries. It's very good. You love sweet, crunchy cherries? Awesome. Ooh, a blackberry pear pie? That sounds... That's a, a flavor combination I wouldn't have thought of. Blackberry and pear. That sounds good, though. Elite combination? I'll have to try it. Uh, what I really love is blueberry pomegranate stuff. Like, Wendy's has this new blueberry pomegranate lemonade. It's so good. Let's see if we can get all three of these. I didn't get any of them. I don't want to waste, or I don't. I don't want to spend time planting bombs. Try, tried a uh, pomegranate tobacco once. She's allergic. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. I love pomegranates. I don't have any food-related allergies. I am allergic to poison ivy, though. Last time I got it, it was real bad. My poor doctor, she was she was severely allergic to poison ivy, so she like wouldn't even come near me. She just uh, prescribed me a whole bunch of ointment. remember how much wood I need for this, but uh, we're at 50, so we might be good. I'll go for 75. Apparently intolerant of opiates, but that's it. Well, I mean, I guess that's a good thing, in a way. I actually I don't know if I've ever been on opiates. 
I don't think I've ever been prescribed them. And this, um, like, hydrocodone is an opiate. I've had that for, uh, having teeth pulled before. Tried to argue with me about how good they are and how I should try one. <laughs> Well, well, uh, you found out that, uh, you can't. I'm, I'm glad you're okay from that, though. Allergies can be dangerous. Oh, come on. Oh, this is not good for chopping wood. Makes sense, it's a, it's a blunt weapon. Uh... Ooh, a shield. Yeah, I'm getting stuck around like 2.7 average. Yeah. You know your allergies? That's good, though. Yeah, I I've been stuck around like 2.7. Yeah, Tw Twitch is, like, super greedy with the numbers. I was there a couple weeks before getting affiliate. That's fair. It's a blessing and a curse, but, uh, I've responsibly managed plenty of addictive meds before. That's good. Yeah, it does make surgery miserable, I bet. Uh, my grandfather was allergic to steroids. He couldn't take any of them. I think my brother is, too. We'll get you I appreciate it, Jeepers. And Shelby. And Beck. You're all amazing. I'm sorry I haven't gone to uh, Gerudo Town yet. I just, I, I really wanted to finish up uh, Terry Town. Okay, that's probably enough, I think. dog's barking at something. wonder what she's barking at. Want to go see the new D&D movie? Want to leave the PC on for you? Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. Have fun. Uh, I was going to watch the D&D movie the other week, but my D&D group canceled on me. How fitting. What kinds of redemptions are you going to do? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I definitely, Guide the Raid is going to be one of them, uh, stream title, stuff like that. Craving popcorn is slushy. I've been craving popcorn a lot lately, too. I love popcorn. Look how nice Terrytown is now. There's no giant rocks, it's all built up. We're going to go attend a wedding. Where is Hudson? There he is. Oh, this is where you get the Vo outfit. Okay. Sometimes I make my hubs drive me to the cinema just to get the popcorn. That's fair. That is completely fair. I mean, I talked earlier and he said that he literally was a priest before he retired. Can't get more priest-like than that. But his name is Capson, so I have no objections there. It really is amazing that you're able to find someone priest-like who also had an acceptable name. Well, next is, uh, of course, we'll have to invite guests in order to have a ceremony. Guests? Well, I'm talking about my boss, Volson, my subordinate, Carson. However, I've got to prepare for the ceremony, so my hands are full. Could you invite them for me? Where are they? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are, they're literally loitering in front of my house. That's where they are. Cool. Oh, I thought I'd, I, I guess I didn't need any more wood. <laughs> Yeah, was typical behavior. Sorry, I didn't see your message until now. You're probably gone, but yeah. There's literally, yeah, they, they're, they are. They're just loitering in front of my house. 
Like, I, I paid them. They built the house. They don't need to stay here. Yeah, you know, if I built a house and, like, the construction people just stayed there all day and night, I think I would call the police and ask them to leave. <laughs> I mean, look at them. They're just, they're just chilling in front of my house. What are you, what are you guys doing here? Hey. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Oh. Hudson's getting married and wants me to attend the wedding? Wow, good on him. Okie doo. I'm in wedding time, baby. Not like there's anything to do here anyway. Yeah, you're just loitering in front of my house. Get packed and head towards Hudson's place, please. Mm -hmm. I call the police and ask the police. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would. <laughs> Carson, we're headed out. Oh. Finally, we've been waiting for this day. Ah, about time they get the fuck off my property. <laughs> Make them pay rent? Yeah, I should. <laughs> yeah, they should have been paying me this whole time. I paid them a lot of money for that. <laughs> Alright, let's go attend this wedding. Firewood not cheap? Yeah, no, it's not. I spent like an hour gathering firewood for them. And I paid them like... 4,000 rupees for everything, too. You know how hard that was to get? I had to sell all my inventory. I wish I had a fireplace, too. It'd be very cozy. They can party, though, so maybe they'll let them stay person. Ah, uh, well, that's true. I definitely think uh, Bolson can party. Carson, maybe not, but Bolson, Bolson is definitely a party animal. Less than 30 minutes until Cobbler. That's so exciting. God, I really want Cobbler now, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to buy the ingredients and make one later. Come here, Hudson. Hey. You extended my invitation for me. Thank you. Now then, Carson and Boss Bolson are waiting for things to begin. Shall we start the ceremony? Of course. Crockpot cobbler, yum. True. Can we get in the crockpot super easy? Quicker in the oven, though? Well, I do have both an oven and a crockpot. So I could make two cobblers at once. Oh, I bet a blueberry cobbler would be so good. Add a little lemon. <laughs> Ahem. Silence, please, everyone. We shall now begin. We are gathered here today to join Hudson and Ronson and matrimony. Hudson, before the eyes of these witnesses and before the goddess of Hylia, do you take Ronson to be your wife, to have and to hold and good times and, and bad? Oy. I do. Excellent. And Ronson, before the eyes of these witnesses and before the goddess of Hylia, do you take Hudson as your lawfully wedded husband in sickness and in health? And do you also vow to name your children in accordance with both in construction and naming guidance mm -hmm. policy? Wait a moment. Those vows are not traditional by anyone's standards. What makes you say that? They're as traditional as it gets. I don't think she means traditional in that sense of the word. A vow of undying tradition. And a vow of guidelines compliance. I'll take that vow. Think of the future generations. Well, those are the guidelines. I do. We'll recall blueberry pie filling in the crock pot first, sprinkle lemon cake mix over it, spoon over six tablespoons of unsalted butter on top, do not mix, on low for six hours, you're welcome, oh, okay, story of horses, thank you, yeah, I, I try, I, I try, <laughs> excellent, <coughs> and so, dearly beloved, please, help me in greeting this newly married couple, 
I wish this new couple nothing but the utmost happiness as they set out on this journey of marital bliss. Little fun fact, every wedding I've been a I've been to, I've been a part of. When my brother got married, I was a groomsman. When my sister got married, I got roped into being the, the DJ, if you will. And uh, when my friend got married, I was a groomsman as well. The only weddings I've been to, I've been a part of. It's weird. Okay. Uh, you know what? Before, before we go to Gerudo... Let's, of course... Oh. Uh, hold on, there's a quest icon here. Vasak! Do you need something from me? Savak! <laughs> yes, Savak! Hey, that is correct. <laughs> Do you remember me? I'm Bronson! The wedding ceremony wasn't what I expected, but it was special all the same. Do you like the dress? I made it myself. No kidding! Although Hudson wanted me to weave the gems he mined into it. So every step down the aisle was a struggle. Well, that's a life for you. With all its twists and turns, I hope you'll stick with us through them. Okay, let's buy this Vo outfit. I, I want to buy. Okay. Did you lay down some sick beats? Uh, I I just pressed play. <laughs> Should I do enchilada casserole or meatloaf next? Uh, go with the enchilada casserole. Look, both are both are valid options, but enchilada casserole just sounds really good. Thirteen hundred rupees, that's so expensive. I can't even afford the pants, can I? No. I do love a good meatloaf. Love I, I love enchiladas, I love meatloaf. I I, I tried a uh, a taco place. I got Sam's. Get those eggs. Hopefully they're not expensive. Answers got to flip a coin. Both, since one is crockpot and one is the oven. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, do both. It's always good to have like leftovers and stuff too. I like food a little too much, and I'll just like eat everything. I'm pretty sure I had to pay the. Uh, the one guy to get the oh. the Gerudo outfit, don't I? Mm. Ah. Oh. Twenty nine of them, yep. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure I have to pay the one guy oh. to get into Gerudo Town. Mm. Two Hello Fresh meals. Awesome. Oh. I've never bought from HelloFresh. Would you recommend it? Oh. Mm. <laughs> oh. Mm. I know uh, Northern Lion. Lion. Oh. He, uh, he, oh. I, I don't remember if it was HelloFresh mm. or a different uh, subscription box service, but he really was like upset oh. with them for a while. Yeah, I don't really intend like upgrading my armor too much, so I don't really care if I sell all the monster parts. You know, I probably watched the uh, gameplay reveal for Tears of the Kingdom like 20 times by now. I still don't know everything. Oh, these sell for a lot. Fresh is the best thing ever. Okay, I'll have to try it sometime. About, like, how much is it, though, for, like, a meal? Because I do like to cook. <laughs> These are the worst parts of the stream, is me just selling stuff or, like, cooking. And I never know what to say for them. No, not one. All of them. Oh, this is for 15 apiece? Nice. 
15 times 37, that's a big number. If you try it, let me know. Oh, okay. It's like $30 per meal, I think. That's not too bad. I mean, I paid like $33 for uh, tacos last night, so... Granted, I ordered a bunch of tacos. It, it wasn't just like one or two. I ordered nine different tacos, so... They were pretty good. It was from a, uh, like an authentic place. In the next town over. What do you do for work? Uh, I don't currently have a job. I'm trying... I w I'd like to do Twitch as a job. <laughs> but, you know, that, that does take a while to, like, actually profit from Twitch. I have to put in a lot of work. So maybe someday. Uh, at the moment, I might... I am kind of looking for, like, a part-time job. I might go work at, like, a, a local restaurant in the mornings or something. Wouldn't be too bad. Okay, now we have our desert outfit. Um, sort these. Okay. How do we do? Gerudo Town? Gotcha, no worries. Yeah. Uh, I, I could easily be a bartender. I used to work at a liquor store, and that was fun. Night shift at a gas station. Hmm. That probably wouldn't be too bad. You're 30 in September for context? Awesome! I'll be 25 in June. Uh, yeah, I have to find the guy that's, like, running around here, don't I? Um... Oh, I could have bought a sand seal this whole time? Happy birthday. Any plans? Uh, no. Not at the moment. I have no idea where this guy is. I think last time, last time I did this quest, he was like running around the. Uh, hold on, I'm gonna look at the quest. Actually, that might help me. Car bazaar. Oh, yeah. Okay, I just have to speak to him at the bazaar. I need a sand seal. Never do anything from a birthday except order a good meal. Awesome. Watch a movie? Oh, really? Okay, I think this place will rent some anyway. Sand seals. I came on foot. One of the secret of catching the seals. Uh, yes, actually, it's been a while since I caught them. It's friendly. What, what what is your secret for catching them? Use a bomb to stun them. I didn't even think of that. It seems I missed. That's fine. Yep. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was good advice. Thank you.
it's now suddenly too cold. To the bazaar. Easy peasy, yeah. That was that was really easy. Okay. I remember where this guy is at. Awfully ominous music. Bro, the suit they made for Blue Beetle looks sick. Uh, I've not seen it yet. Ooh, 50 minutes into the collar? Awesome! I'm gonna pack it into a container and clean the crock pot? Awesome. Cobbler's so good. Yeah, I've not I've not seen the new Blue Beetle uh. suit. Hmm. So you've heard about a man who snuck into Gerudo mm. Town? Oh, I don't know anything about him. Sorry, I couldn't have you any more help. Squint suspiciously. Mm-hmm. Mm you're making my cheeks warm looking at me like that. You're a man. Mm -hmm. Oh my. You sure say funny things, young man. Anyway, if you don't need anything, you should be off. Oh. Mm -hmm. Did I did I hit the wrong dialogue option? Oh. <laughs> You're making my cheeks warm. You're very beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, such a nice thing to say. And I'm sure you'd agree that these clothes only help me look right. I saw you were streaming, but I was busy laying in bed pretending I didn't have to use the bathroom for two hours. Yeah, I feel that. What do you think? You want to buy them for? Yeah. Oh. Mm. Living life? Yeah. I get that. Can't do it right now. Don't worry. I'll look away. This music sounds like it's from Trigon. Whoa. Yo! You look adorable. Oh. Make for quite a good looking gal. That's a traditional Gerudo outfit. Such a striking look around here. I doubt anyone would even suspect you're a man. On top of that, it breathes so well that it's sure to help you deal with the desert heat, at least a oh. little. So glad I was able to help you mm -hmm. out. If you're free to grab something to eat sometime, yeah. keep me in mind. Oh. <laughs> it, it, it is a huge vibe. Mm. Can more ladies' clothing come back anytime? Oh, oh that's fair. <laughs> Absolutely no idea where that sand seal I had went. Guess it's gone forever. It's a little too cold to be wearing this outfit, though. I'm supposed, supposed to get on the treadmill, but all I want to do is nap. I feel that. You had to choose one fruit or vegetable eating for the rest of your life, and you weren't allowed to have any other. Oh. Uh. I don't know. I, I genuinely, I can't, I don't know. You'll do it for me? Okay. And, and, what, what is it? What, what do you, what do you choose? This thing has a lot of nerve being alive. There's Gerudo Town. Am I a fan of potatoes? Yeah, you know what? Potatoes, potatoes is fair. It's fair. Potatoes is very fair. Uh, for fruit, I don't know. I'd probably choose like apples or something. Is, is it like a, a specific brand of apple, or just like apples in general? Wow, that killed me. I 
don't like apples. You don't care. You don't like apples, and I don't care for peanut butter, but I love them together for whatever reason. Oh, huh, that is a little weird. Ten minutes until the cobbler's done. Awesome. Saints. Uh, no annoying technically. Technical. You choose apple. It's only specified by color. I would go with red apples then, because there's a huge variety of red apples. Hey. Uh -huh. What do you got? Oh. Don't care. Ah. All right, we got to put on our little crop top here. No one suspects a thing. Here we are at the uh, Gerudo Town, everybody. Welcome. I love how they let Gorons here, even though they're they're not female. We've never met a female Goron, so uh, that holds true. Apple chips are actually kind of banging. Banana chips are the goat, but... Yeah, no, I like... I really like apple chips. Apple chips and banana chips are both very good. Riju, Gerudo Chief. Yet another traveler. How I always forget that she's actually voiced. Oh. Sort of more versatile, but they're Can just hard to do much with. Rather interesting there. I like caramel apples too. Candy apples suck though. Oh. Bananas are really good for making banana bread with. We're gonna declare business, but come no closer. Hold on, Balu Buliara. This one appears to be more than a common traveler. You there? What is your name? Uh. Biggest Dickus? Does he come all the way here to tell me, Link? I can call him the Boris. Yeah, I don't like candy apples. They just get stuck in your teeth. The only ones who could never control them were champions like Lady Urbosa. Champions died in Calamity a hundred years ago. Hmm. hmm. Budiara, a memory just jumped into my head, something my mother spoke of. A calamity happened and the Princess of Hyrule placed a fallen swordsman into a deep sleep. That swordsman, much like our new friend here, was named Link, though it always seemed more legendary. Hmm. In fact. Bananas are great for a lot of stuff. Bread, muffins on ice cream, covered in chocolate, and pancakes are well. That's fair. The fact that you don't choose what you can't eat anything with yeah that's true appears to be a priceless relic of the sheikah can't imagine that would give something so valuable a simple drifter can you <laughs> i remember ever hearing of a hyaline vi among the champions Aww. wait a moment you're a vo <laughs> a vo within our walls is a great crime but a vo who is a champion well we'd never mistreat a friend of lady urbosa if you're here to help us with the boris we are allies huh? you saw it on your way to our town Divine Beast without the Boris. Dude, bread is too damn good. Keto is impossible for- Yeah, I could never do keto. And smoothie, I love smoothies, yeah. Mm. Had to do something to stop it. We have yet to find any way to appease the Divine Beast on our own. You truly are a champion. Perhaps you'll be able to enter into Boris and claim it's mm. calm its anger. Lady Riju, I don't see how you can trust a complete stranger with something as important as this task. Perhaps if this person were first to prove his worth by recovering your stolen thunder helm. Hmm. Ah, yes, an interesting question. A suggestion. You see, there is only one thing in all of Hyrule that can withstand the lightning from the forest. The thunder helm. Family heirloom and relic of the Gerudo, but as Biliar says, it was stolen from us. You needn't worry, Lady Rijo. If he truly is a champion, it should be an easy task for him. Oh. Our soldiers can tell you all you need to know about the thieves who stole Lady Rijo's heirloom. Heard through this arc, head through this arc, and we'll lead to the barracks and seek out Captain Teak. Mm. Tika? Without my arrow, we'll never be able to approach Naboris. Heh, <laughs> <laughs> you know. I take heart in having such a rare visitor as yourself. Lady Herbosa must be looking out, out for us. Used to be plant-based, and I felt so good on it. Made some killer food, too. 
That's fair. Stop being plant-based because I moved out of California to New England and the produce here is gross and expensive. Is the produce really better in California? Never would have known. I've never been to California. What are you doing in here? This is the barracks of the chief's guards, not a place for tourists to gather. And high alert after the recent theft, so you should clear out. Oh. What, will the say oh. My apologies. I'm the officer in charge of the soldiers, Captain Ticket. The chief's heirloom was stolen by thieves along to the Yiga clan the other day, so everyone is mm. on edge. Chairman the Yiga's hideout is in Kadasu Valley, but... Soldiers are all exhausted, so I was just thinking about requesting some extra help. Oh. Hey, everyone, listen up. The produce is incredible in Cali. That's where it's all grown, and yeah, that's great year-round because of the weather. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just waiting from eating greens medically. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, you could. I don't think you could do plant-based realistically. Melty Bear is a good friend of mine, by the way. If you didn't know, Jeepers. Oh, you missed it earlier. My my friend Shelby was in chat, and she said she's going to see the uh, the uh, D and D movie. And I told her that uh, we canceled. <laughs> Self part of our unit. You have any questions? The troop, I'm happy to help. Okay. All right, we're off to here. Wanna go with you today? Um Yeah, after I'm done streaming we can. I really had no plans for today anyway, so I don't remember how to get the crescent, or uh, the, the skull armor. I think you have to, like, listen in on something. Let's go over here. Or, no, you have to, like, go to the bar and listen in. Sounds Okay. You really want the D20? I want the D20 bucket, too. How much is it, do you know? Well, to use frame back as mine. Yeah. Thirty, you'd assume. Oh, that—that that is a little expensive for a, uh, a popcorn bucket. To be fair, it would make like a good dice holder afterwards. I'm running out of room in my my bag. Karasu Canyon. Friend who is getting paid to watch stream. Nice. Well, that's how it's done. I'm avoiding work watching my stream right now. Pocket walking. True. Two of our words have never been spoken. Hey, it's Kilton. I don't really intend to buy anything from Kilton. Whose canyon start? Over this way a little bit. It's part of the reason I pop in and out, chat. Oh, that's fair. Applied Link lost again in Ocarina because of this game. Uh, this game is at the end of the timeline, and um, Ocarina Time has splits the timeline in three. So when uh, the, the three timelines is like the adult timeline where Link wins, the child timeline where Link reports Ganon to the king and they believe him, and then there's the downfall timeline where Ganon kills Link, and that's like. 
Zelda 1 to um, Link to the Past, stuff like that. It's basically like all the like 2D games are in the downfall timeline. Or before Ocarina of Time. Or. Cobbler is done! Congratulations, I hope it's good. I hope the Cobbler is really good. Yeah, um... It, it, it's weird to explain, but... Apparently, Breath of the Wild is at the end of all three timelines. Somehow. We don't fully know how yet, and then obviously Tears of the Kingdom is after Breath of the Wild. But there's a popular theory that Tears of the Kingdom is also going to be before Skyward Sword. And that the whole timeline is just a massive circle. But that's not proven yet, so purely speculation. Is it funny for me that Ganon went from Pigman to Mill Bottle to Puss, Puss of Van from DS3? Yeah. Puss of Van. Oh, okay. Wait. That was something I didn't have yet. Electric Cephalina. Orange man demands me. He is a very demanding man. I have my orange man with me as well. He's just napping on my bed, though. As they do. Wow, what are the odds of getting all three of Nightbot's messages at once? for this. Never bought this Sheikah Stealth Armor. But I got this armor. We don't need it yet, obviously, but uh, we will. Look at these frogs. <laughs> there he goes. Just goes to show. You don't need more arrows to win. Okay. First Yiga encounter of the area. There's probably going to be more, I think. Give me the rupees. Give me the duplex bow. No? Okay. Money and bananas. <clears throat> I'm kind of bad at the stealth section, so you going to overnight me some? Yeah. Overnight them some. Overnight back some some complex cheapers. Overnight me some too. I'll pay the ninety dollar shipping fee.
stuff slaps? I bet it does. Sounds amazing. This really reminds me of the entrance to the uh, the Shadow Temple in uh, Ocarina of Time. Obviously, it wants me to use a torch in some way or another. Okay. That's right. Had to burn the walls. Just gonna open all these up real quick. Only one of them is the right answer, but I want to open them all up. Hey, that was the right door. Awesome. Why did it put out my torch, though? Oh no, my spike Boko shield is bad, the damage, whatever will I do? Whoops. What are you saying whoops for? Was it something I did? Or, oh, whoop. Oh, excited. Gotcha. Okay, that's the correct way to go. He smothered me with love for two minutes and decided he wished I was dead and walked away like I don't... It's just, well, that sounds like an orange cat. Typical orange cat behavior. Crockpot is going to be a nightmare to clean. Yeah. Yeah, that's the, the bad thing about doing that. Is, uh... I always have to clean it afterwards. <laughs> in here, nothing. Dude, their durability system is a mega cringe, yeah. I mean, I don't mind it, because there's weapons literally everywhere. So, like, it, it's not a big issue to me at all. Unless it's actively a survival game, durability is stupid, eh. I get- I understand why they put it in this game. They want you to use different weapons. Because it's fun. Unique weapons tend to have super low durability. Yeah, they all- every weapon in this game has low durability. Hey, what are you doing here? This is the hideout of those Yuga thieves who stole the Thunderhelm. Call their friends for sure. Uh, Come along. It's going to distract them, but I don't know how. Yeah, yeah. Throw bananas at them. Got it. Makes me not want to use them at all. So you can collect. I mean, see, that makes me want to use them even more. Because, you know, they, they break. And it's just, oh, there's just another weapon right there waiting for you. I don't remember how to open her cage. No worries, though. We've got the best stealth armor in the entire game. Let's throw a banana at this guy. We've only got six bananas, so... Ah, oh, shit. Do you think, obviously, like, the Boko and still stuff is non-issue? 
Well, we have messed up here, it would seem. Um... Oops. Alright, trouble time. Have fun on the treadmill. Yeah, that was definitely a tactical error on my part. Just gotta walk away until they calm down. Just like GTA. Alright, take two. You'll still be here? Just, uh, fast walk so I can chat and stuff? Okay. Appreciate it. What is up with this? I literally have some- I'm literally wearing the best stealth armor in the game. And it's like, no, they still see you. How disrespectful. Fortunately, these guys don't know how to walk outside of the door, so... Way through days, you're too with the easy guild quest line. You're right. Too out of shape to run quite- yeah, I feel that. I'm also too out of shape to run. Do I have any stealth up foods? I have tons. Okay, we're very stealthy now. I'm moving so impossibly so that they'll never be able to see me. Okay, we'll do this a little differently. Banana. Okay, there we go. Past the first guard. Wow, he can, he can, he can see. You want to get to an eight-minute mile? Awesome. Determined to get toned and in shape again. It's a good goal to have. I wish you the best of luck on that. I know there's a way to, like... Yeah, there we go. Stealth jump. In the game being in a game, I hate farming consumables so much. Just stock up on the best healing items in games, say, fuck bonuses. Round is a shape, though. Definitely doable. I'm just gonna stick with it. I'm doing good so far. Good. Good to hear. We love it. Here we are at DK's Banana Horde. And then there's Chunky. He's dead. Not just around, you're rotund. Well, that's a valid shape too. DK. Chunky's fuck. <laughs> it seems I have made another mistake. Chunky's dead. TK. Link is dead. I remember those wind slicers, uh, hurting a little more. What? Again? Did you not get the memo? <laughs> We're aware, fool, the eye of the Yiga. So you've made another mistake. <laughs> yeah, literally. Literally me. 
every single day too. All right, let's try this again. This time, more banana, less death. Why did it? Oh, that's. It started me in a weird place. Okay. Here we go again. We offer the guy a banana in these trying times. He did not see the banana fall. Okay. So we're going to place a tactical a tactical banana here. He's going to see that banana. He's going to go... Ooh, ooh. See? Okay. We're going to show our, ourselves briefly to this guy. I'm not... I didn't eat my stealth up skewer. Love that Ashley is now a rat because of the comical large ears. Oh, on uh, Resident Evil. Mousely, or whatever they've been calling her. Alright, now we climb back up here and uh, reconnect to DK's banana cord. Because we need the we need the nanners. I remember the first time I did this, I didn't. It took me forever to do this, like a couple hours. All the nanners, yes, love the nanners. Sacrificial banana. Oh shit. Oh shit. I don't know how they saw me. I forgot banana in your grocery. Oh no. Uh, objective survive. Okay, there's the door out. See you later. I love bananas. Rather than let them kill me, I'm gonna go all the way back to the beginning myself. <laughs> okay, they should all calm down now, now that we're outside. Okay, back we go. What is this, the uh, fourth attempt? This time more bananas? I <laughs> literally kicked him in the head as I passed by. Here we go. T 
she bagged him and went, hmm. What's going on to that nanner? He just, he sensed the nanner. That's all he cares about, his nanners. Please don't come over here. He's like, is that? What is that? Is that a banana? Is that a banana? Oh my god, it's a banana. Whoop. What? This is bullshit, Doralingus. Ah, whatever. You there. One third of the way there. Nice. I'm proud of you. The instant 45 degree flip. Yeah. <laughs> True. Okay. Wait, which one? Oh, that's right. It spawns you at the one. I, I keep forgetting that. There we go. You feeling the burn? That means it's working. Uh, I have to go rob the horde again. Stealthier this time, I guess. <clears throat> okay, here we go. You know, every time Melty Bear is in chat, I, I end up, like, not being able to do basic tasks. Don't know what, what's up with that. Oh, there's a chest here that I missed. Topaz! Here we have the mighty Yiga warriors. Obsessed with bananas. More than anything else in this world. They love their bananas. That's the common denominator? Yeah, it, it really is. Okay, we lure. He inspects. We stealthily run past. Okay, we made it. We're done. We're through. Love how that's their most valuable possession. Oh, wait. Hold up. I didn't see these before. Yep. I know if I if I go around there, I can, like, collect all the minerals, but I kind of don't care. Topaz. Nice. Valuable possession is my toothbrush. You're not even joking, really? Huh. You have one of those, um... Like, $200 toothbrushes? I thought about getting one of those once. Hmm. 
We're going to save here, by the way. All right. Who the heck are you? And what are you doing in my napping spot? Wait a minute! That thing on your hip, is that... Could it be a Sheikah Slate? $300? Or, Jesus, wow. I have a car and a MacBook. It's not my most valuable. It's my... Well, that's fair. It's a Sheikah Slate. Then that means... Yeah, it's you. You're that link guy I've been looking for. What luck! My scouts are out in the field looking high low, but you just wander into my hideout. Oh, excuse me. I haven't introduced myself yet. I am the leader of the Yiga clan. The strong, the burly, the one, the only. Master Koga! Now prepare yourself. I'm gonna, uh, I said I was gonna save. I, I, I should probably do that. <laughs> Halfway there? Awesome. In the, eye, in the eye of the wall she is. This is genuinely the best song in the entire game. I love Master Koga. He's such a doof. He's a, he's a doofus. <laughs> what an odd place to pose. To pause. Why do they always make the leader of the elite groups overweight? That's that's a good question. What does Ronald McDonald look dude even talk about? I don't even know. Oh, I missed. What? I missed twice. Up our combat a little bit. Messed it up, whatever. It's fine. Messed it up again, that's okay. So much. He's such a goofball. We need more. Genuinely, we need more bosses like this in this game. He's the only unique boss. One of these days? Yeah. <laughs> He's steaming. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, poor Master Koga. Who would have thought I'd be done in like this? By this guy of all people. You think I'm just going to let this stand, do you? Hmm, <laughs> I almost lost my temper there. Ah, what a pain. Can't go out this way. What to do, what to do. All the Ganons are virtually the same, and the Lionel Litter are all the same in the old game. So many different bosses, yeah. <laughs> I caught him monologuing, by the way. I need to bust out my serious moves, a secret technique taught by my father's mother's father. It will destroy you! This is the end! Ah! Oh, maybe.
Maybe it's just a tad too big. Are you still over there? Well, no matter. Pretty soon you'll be gone. And not just from my line of sight. Only the leader of the Yiga clan can use this secret technique. It is the ultimate technique, huh? Coward, I shall be remembered. The Yiga clan can track you to the ends of Hyrule. That was easy. 23 down, let's go, awesome. Hope the one coming out will focus on the bosses more than gameplay. Well, something I've seen from the Tears of the Kingdom so far is that there is at least twice as many enemies than there was in, uh... Oh, two-thirds, okay. That's fair. Makes a little more sense. Yeah, there's, there's twice as many enemies than there were in Breath of the Wild. I hope Master Koga returns. Would be pretty amazing if he did. He's probably dead, though. You know, falling several hundred feet into a seemingly bottomless pit. Trailed by a spiky ball. Assume you're playing this on official... Yeah. No, I am, actually. I'm playing this on my Switch. Like, it's, it's running through my capture card, and I'm, I'm playing it on my Switch with my Pro Controller. Something someone's cooking smells really good. I didn't know I had a capture card? Yeah. Yeah, I bought a capture card not that long ago. I've actually, I've never uh, ran a Switch emulator before, so I don't even know how it would run. Saba Saba. Saba Saba. Oh, got to, yeah. Uh, no, Aver Media. I finally found the vow of my dreams and just recently married him. I thought I had finally found happiness. But then my husband fell ill with a rare disease, one difficult to cure, and the only thing I can save him is inner Mabuga. I like fighting Mabuga, actually. Yeah, uh, I, I went with Avervania, because that's what Vinny uses, and I trust Vinny's opinion on stuff. Oh. We're looking for Radio Riju, she's on the second floor. Yes. If you're interested in knowing which one I have specifically, it's the, um... I think it's the Gamer 3 Pro? Something like that? Let me see. It, yeah, it's the Aver Media Live Gamer Extreme 3. So it's 4K capture. I think it was like two hundred dollars, something like that. I like it a lot, though. Who are you? You know, before we go visit uh, Chief Riju. One hundred fifty, I assume, off discount. Um, maybe. I, I would highly recommend it, though, if you want to, like, stream from a console. Or if you just want to, like, if you have a streamer computer set up. Like, you have your, your gaming computer and your streaming computer. I'd recommend doing it like that. Can you send me the link? Uh, yeah. Hold on, I'll post the link in chat. Oh wait, no, that's right. I, it's it's an Amazon. You have to buy it like through Amazon or something. So I'll post an Amazon link.
Yeah, it's like a, it's like one hundred and fifty dollars. So it, it's on sale right now, actually. Let me make sure it's actually sold. This is Aver Media selling it. Big one. I don't like how my PC runs trying to stream newer stuff. I feel that actually. Five more minutes on a free. Awesome. Uh, who's the seller? Actually, I'll just go into my orders because I, I bought it from Aver Media themselves. Oh, that's right. Two factory authentication. Give me a second here. Yeah, that's the one I got. I like it a lot. Nepha's grace is ready. The masculine urge to be on top of the tallest thing you possibly can. I actually went up here because I knew there was a Korok, so... I've been lacking on getting them. Riju! I don't think I have a free HDMI. Oh, well, good thing <laughs> HDMIs are not uh, expensive. And if need be, you can always buy a uh, HDMI to DisplayPort adapter. Oh, you needn't say a word. As a chief of Gerudo, I can sense the power of the heirloom flowing from you. I know that you've succeeded. I am, as you have no doubt noticed, still but a child. Mm -hmm. The people look on me with nothing but warmth in their eyes, but even this brings me some pain. I must admit, I tried so hard to be worthy of their love and to be a worthy chief and to prove myself. To, my, to myself that I was worthy to. I'm gonna get all the Koroks next. That's fair. Um, you met the port. Um, I, I tried getting all the Koroks once, and uh, I would never do that again. My family arrow was stolen, and I felt as though a shadow had fallen over me. Yes, your arrival in the midst of all this must be the work of Lady Urbosa. Now please give me the helm. Yeah, here you go. Um, how do I look? It's a little big on you. Oh, uh, you have exactly one free port? That's fair. I think I also had exactly one free. Well... I, I, I will say, uh, the HDMI ports don't hook up to your computer. Unless you're, like, doing a streaming computer. Uh, it, it runs through USB. I said child through the longest time, just thought she was short. <laughs> That's fair. I kind of just thought she was short at first, too. Melty Bear's fiancé is very oh. short. Well, you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much. It comes with a USB port. Own appointed night. Or, not a port, she but was a, out on a USB. Survey all day today. Still as the sand now. So, spill it, boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? No. <laughs> it's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. She gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, she's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this ceiling power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. 
Can you be sure to protect her with your life? It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... What do you mean by that, Arposa? <laughs> Arposa! What was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you... What are you doing here? <laughs> what? What's so funny? <laughs> I'm gonna save him and get a Shuri mic. What is a Shuri mic? Or a Shure mic? I'm gonna look that up real quick. Oh yeah, uh, I don't I don't allow links, I'm sorry. <laughs> I also need to redo that command. Or uh not saying. Click the show anyway. Here, I'll I'll post it in chat. For, on your behalf. That's the the microphone Melty Bear is talking about. Here, actually, you know what I'm you know what I'm gonna do? There. You're VIP now. <clears throat> I don't know what that gets you, but I feel like it timed you out too. I was just making sure. What's wrong? You're just staring. Anyway, what matters now is... How? How is it? Do I look alright? It's a tad big. <laughs> you don't say. The threat Divine Beast Vaughn the Boris poses has only grown since we began searching for the heirlooms. We believe the Gerudo town itself may be in danger before too long. As chief, and as a Gerudo, I must find some way to stop this before it threatens my people. Yeah, I'll help you. <clears throat> I won't do it right now, but... Giving simple confidence, confident pledge to support you from the battle to put me at ease? I don't know. Look up post. There's only one way to get close to the Naboris, and that's with the help of Sandseal. Look up post isn't too far from there. You should... Get some practice anyway. Thank you for the fun. You're gonna be hopping off? Okay, have fun! And uh, enjoy your drive home. Still, it really is a little big. Don't take that out of context. Okay, I'm actually going to end the video here, so thank you all so much for watching. I love you all so much. Have a fantastic day. Remember to like the video. If you like the video, leave a comment. If you want to tell me something, and subscribe if you like my content.